We're all misfits, too. Maybe we could stay here for a while. Well, you'd have to get permission from King Moonraiser. Who's he? He rules here. Every night, he searches the entire Earth. When he finds a misfit toy, one that no little girl or boy loves, he brings it here to live in this island till someone wants it. He's holding court in his castle right now. Come closer. What do you desire? Well, we're a couple of misfits from Christmas Town, and now we'd like to live here. No, that would not be possible. This island is for toys alone. How do you like that? Even among misfits, you're misfits. Unlike playthings, a living creature cannot hide himself on an island. But perhaps, being misfits yourselves, you might help the toys here. Help them? Yes. When someday you return to Christmas Town, would you tell Santa about our homeless toys? I'm sure he could find little boys and girls who would be happy with them. A toy is never truly happy until it is loved by a child. When and if we ever get back, we'll tell Santa, sir. Good. You are free to spend the night. Footman, show our friends to their chambers. No, it's all settled. We leave tomorrow together. But the Abominable will see my nose and get us all. I've got to go alone. Nonsense. It's all for all and, and one for... I mean, one, one for... Ah, let's get some shut eye. But it's all settled. Well, poor Rudolph realizes that he can't endanger his friends' lives anymore. And so, that night, he decides to strike out on his own. Goodbye, Cornelius. I hope you find lots of tinsel. Goodbye, Hermie. Whatever a dentist is, I hope someday that you're the greatest. <laughs>